Data. Firm. Welcome to the first impressions of Harvestella. During the last Nintendo Direct, they dropped the prologue demo, which is a thing that Square Enix has been doing quite a bit with their white font underline games recently. And this isn't exactly one of those. I mean, if I go back to the home menu for a second, it's not white font underline, and they actually have, like, a logo around it. So, oh, yeah, there it is again. I guess I didn't need to go to the home menu for that. I'm a fan of the music already. <laughs> Very tempting to just sit here and chill with it, especially because I'm dropping frames and I'm gonna try to fix that. Okay, is there anything else? Looks like we're stable again. So, pressing the any button as per usual. I went with left bumper. You can go buy the game on the eShop if you want. Always gotta check the options though. HD Rumble can stay. Camera can stay. Until I figure out if I don't like it or not. Overall volume high. <laughs> I like the voice volume higher than the EGM whenever they let me, so I appreciate that setting. This demo is available in English, French, German, Spanish, Japanese. And the voices are available in English and Japanese. So we start a new game. They'll ask about the language one more time. This is a trial version in which you can play fully from the beginning to the second chapter. The demo will end upon completion of the second chapter of the story, or when 15 days have passed in-game. The data can be transferred to the retail version. Thank you, Harvestella team. So I don't know how long the demo will last exactly, but that gives us an idea. I identify as male. <laughs> see so there's there's four skin tones two body type got that air time hmm I kind of like that one Ooh, now the eyes. Now we're talking options. Welcome, we're just making ourselves right now. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, this one's a bit more than a farming sim, and it was also introduced in the June Partner Direct. So it wasn't surrounded by all the other farming sims until they reintroduced it at the most recent Direct. I'll take purple. The fault name is Ein. I'll take it because I hate naming things. <laughs> I'm so bad at it. I mean, sometimes I put a lot of effort into nicknaming Pokemon, or I'll like do some research and stuff to find a good nickname, but. This is not a Pokemon. Fine. Fine. Fine, sleepy head. It's time to wake up. Very creepy sounding right now. Oh, this game definitely does. I saw a little bit of it in the treehouse segment that it got. 
Now, Nintendo's definitely given this game some attention, which is fair because it's a Switch exclusive, at least for the time being. You should be all better now. Come on, let's go. My character's got such a headache that the floaters have spread to the world itself. Look at all those floaters that they're seeing. I guess I can say that he's seen because I chose male. Right stick moves the camera. As one would expect, B to jump. A to open door. What are you doing out and about tonight of all nights? Hurry home while you still have air in your lung. Oh no, the grid, it's trapped me. It's gravely quiet. Okay, this is a square game, so when I read that, <laughs> my first thought was, it's bravely default. But it's not. <laughs> Search, general store, 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. Big scary monsters will gobble you up if you're still outside when quiet has come. Sorry, mommy said I'm not to open the door. Looks like there's no way to get in. Definitely can't break down the door if there's a child on the other side. Certainly don't have enough age in my body to be that strong. Who would... Now, the, the child is too much, man. We're powerless. You might just be the one who could save the world. And the girl. Hmm. Ah, wonderful questions. But we can only ask one, probably. Unless it lets us ask the other two afterwards. Sometimes games are like that. The first one is a bit presumptuous, like I'm gonna go along with them. Let's just start with where are we? Well, I can't tell you that yet. There will come a time when you will have to choose between this world and the one that existed until now. That sounds very familiar to another game that I played, but I won't say which one. <laughs> But, don't forget. This is the story of your world. And as long as you love it, you will find a way. So, no matter how hard it gets, no matter how hopeless it may feel at times, don't turn away from it. And we're walking, and we're walking. Still, everything is bright and shiny. Well, I mean, in a foggy sort of way. And that's Harvestella. We died. Bit of a short demo, but you know what? I'm pretty... <laughs> there's always that... I feel like there's always that joke to make about these demo games. 
When was the last time I played a demo and I didn't joke about how short it was because they either reached the credits or the character died or something? Why now? I should be out on Doctor's Round. Excuse me, you. Don't you think it's about time you woke up now? No? That's fine. I have something for that. Oh, there's the color. Oh, you were awake. Forget I said that. It's not like I was going to use magic on you to wake you up or anything. I can ask where I am again. Or I can ask who this person is. No, I'll be nice and show interest in them. I'm Cress. I'm the doctor of Left Villain. Down at the bottom of this hill that we call Bird's Eye Bray. Now it's my turn. I don't think I've seen you around here before. No local in their right mind would be walking out there in quietest. Are you a traveler or something? Could I potentially be an octopath traveler? I hear there's like eight of them, soon to be sixteen. I'm... Hmm? Seems like your memory is a bit fuzzy. Almost like I'm an RPG protagonist. Well, never mind. I've got to go. Come to my clinic and left when you're feeling a bit more with it. Hey, I'm hip. I'm with it. I'm playing the fresh new release of the demo. I'm cool. This icon indicates a place where the story will progress. Oh, time to run away from it. No! Hexagon's my one weakness. That giant red thing is still there. Do anything but the crystal. Uh, just look at him, I guess. Well, uh, that's enough crystal watching. Ah, more hexagon. Hello, storage box. You can store items in yellow storage boxes. All of them are connected to each other on the inside. I got nothing. It's town time. Darn, you're right. Well, it's not like this is a farming- Oh, wait a minute. Hey, are you okay? You look kinda out of it. Ooh, I know. You're the one Cress was talking about. You were found collapsed on the hill, right? Anyway, I'm Van. This is Left Villain. If you're looking for Cress, she's probably in her clinic. You show me where it is. Oh, you want me to take you? Sorry, no can do. I may not look it, but I'm actually super busy right now. I'm right in the middle of a game of Princess and the Omen. Really thought he was gonna say hide and seek. And after this, I'm gonna play Anelu Catch with Vent and everyone. 
What happened to children's game? When did they get so hard? It's not hard to find, though. It's at the top of the hill in the square. You can't miss it. Point. Still pointing. It's really easy to get there. Just follow the street and then climb the steps. I'll see you later. I gotta get back to my game. So do I, man. So do I. Ooh, there's our map. Behold the map. Ooh, this game has fishing. Probably expected that from a farming sim, though. Or partial farming sim. See, I expect this to be a bit closer to, say, Sakuna of Rice of Ruin, where the farming is really just like the buffing in between battles. But we'll see how true that is. Fiatus has passed. I can finally hang all this laundry I've let pile up. Although, Fiatus is pretty, isn't it? I think that's what makes it all the more unsettling. I wonder if that's what life after death looks like. Oh my, it's not like me to get so grimly poetic. I promise to play Princess and the Omen with Van and Malika today. Oh, a traveler. Welcome to Left Village. Oh, wait, that's a mother. Eh, whatever. Left benefits from all four seas light. Seas light. Is it sea slight or seas light? I feel like it's seas light. As in the, the light from the seasons. Or from the seas. Probably the seas onions. So we experience all four seasons here. It makes life very comfortable. Ooh, okay, fishing mini games. Let's see, which ones have I played? There's a very basic fishing in Animal Crossing. There's some quick time event fishing in Fire Emblem Three Houses. I do not like the way that Stardew Valley handles fishing because I did play a tiny bit of the Switch version and I immediately went to fish as soon as I could and the controls on Switch are immensely unwieldy. I could not catch a single fish, no matter how hard I tried, and that's why I stopped playing the game. I can't, I'm not allowed to do anything fun around here, like barge into people's homes. Ah, uh, what other fishing minigames exist? There's a tiny bit of fishing in Monster Hunter Rise. I don't think it's the best, but it functions. I can actually catch stuff in it. Um, or hexagons. Darn you. How oh, cool, I can jump over fences. Not every game would let you do that. Or not fishing. What other games do have fishing? I am struggling right now <laughs> to think of any such thing. I, Zelda usually has fishing, but I haven't played most of the ones that do. Okami has fishing, but I've never played that one myself. I've just kind of seen it. Here's our actual destination. I'm going to look around a tiny bit more before going in. Because I don't think we have any sort of real time passage going on yet. I feel like the game would have warned me if we did. Or that we'd already see the sky changing. Usually they don't activate real time day-night cycles until after you get past tutorial stuff. Fishing. I don't think there's ever been fishing in a Mario game. 
There is that fishing pond in Kirby in the Forgotten Land. Which one gets me hooked the most? Oh, Link's Away bad. Yeah, Link's Awakening had fishing. I did play that one. Oh, 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 um. Oh, what was it? Oh, hmm. I, th I thought I just thought of one. Oh, oh, oh. God, it was so obvious. Okay. <laughs> My favorite fishing minigame, obviously, now that I give it any modicum of thought, is Nintendo Labo Variety Kit Fishing Rod. I mean, you can really feel the tension in that one. So realistic. I also just remembered Sonic Adventure had fishing with Big the Cat, but definitely not my favorite. That one gave me such a headache as a kid. I did eventually beat that game, though. Damn, you're back. Now that you're here, would you mind mixing up the mayor's medicine? Hello. Oh, it's you. Welcome, come in. How are you feeling? Remembering anything yet? I see. Well, you were outside during quietus. Uh, people keep using that Q word. I've only heard it in Triangle Strategy, but I don't think my character was technically in that game. Oh dear, you've forgotten about quietus too. Even we doctors still know very little about it. Quietus is the season of death. When dust from the sea's light is abnormally emitted into the atmosphere, it comes between the four seas. We believe the dust can be deadly if it enters the body. So everyone usually stays inside during quietus. So has that actually been proven though, or are you all just being super cautious and maybe it's harmless? Now then, come over here, please. Why are you just standing there? I'm about to give you a medical exam. Press gives you a medical exam. For now, your body seems to be in working order. You're very lucky for someone who fell ill during quietus. It's a miracle you're still alive. Anyway, this works out for me too. I was just running out of beds, so it's a good thing you're better now. So now, regarding your next... Shake, 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 shake. My controller is not rumbling for that, which seems like an odd choice. You would think it would. Was that an earthquake? It's so dark out. Press, it's an emergency. Jim, what was that shaking just now? The sea's light is acting weird. Come quick. What could those tremors have been? Go after them. Oh, and you have any supplies that I can steal? I mean, we just met. Oh, I can't talk to the people who are trying to rest off their illness. Okay then, fine. If they don't want visitors. Wow, how'd you get the hexagons in your home? I feel like that's in feat of engineering. Oh, is that the sea's light? <gasps> This divine retribution, our time has come. The sea's light is intensifying, but why? Quietus is meant to be over already. Look. The 
so pink. That one's so blue. And this one's more of a lavender. I guess that one is white. I'm running out of colors because they're all kind of on the same palette. Oh, 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 I know. If we go into one of those, we can descend from Skyloft and reach the surface. Nailed it. <laughs> what was that? Did you see that? I told you it's divine punishment. Can it land in the North Square? I'm scared. Look at you two scaredy cats. Our town is in peril. We've got to go and find out what's happening. Wait. Hey, don't run off like that. Jim, let's go. There might be casualties at the scene. Hopefully not too many, because those kids may <laughs> those kids are in for a rude awakening. <laughs> then again, they're kids, basically fearless. Nothing can stop them. In fact, they might even be able to handle the hexagon. Wish I was a kid. I can't believe it. How could something so massive fall out of the sky? Imagine if the Order were here today. Imagine how many people would have been injured. I hope everyone's alright. On the bright side, it looks like no one got hurt. Stay away from the crystal, everyone. It could have harmful effects on the body. Can someone inform the mayor? He should be back in town by now. We will. Ben, Van, come on. It's our time to shine. Let's go. You know, being kids and all, they have all the energy to run back to town. All right, everyone, show's over. Take over from here so the rest of you can go home. Oh, you must be the traveler my sister told me about. You better go home, too. But I don't have a home. Probably. <laughs> Wait, is this... An entrance? You mean, you can go inside? I mean... And is one way to look at it. Will you though? Would you though? According to the top left of the screen, yes, with no objection or hesitation. Hey! Hey buddy, I'm just doing what the top left of the screen told me to. It's like I told Van earlier, I gotta get back to the game. No one told you to go in there. Uh, yes, the to again, the top left of the screen. You hear it too, right? When the top left of the screen, that part of your head tells you to do something, you just have to do it. I'll be fine. You're still recovering. Um, I got plenty of time to recover. You got the whole loading screen. I've not actually played Hades and Sure Mario Party, uh, but I did settle on Labo, a Labo fishing rod. 
You all right? They're in pain, but still breathing. Pain in on. Hey, are you okay? What's going on in there? There's a person. Person? Like a human person? No, like a bird person. What is this? Thanks. Traveler, get away from it now. But why? <laughs> but why? Why? Because that thing is an omen. Ah, well, okay, look. We found the omen. Now we just need to find the princess. And then the kids' game will be finished. And they'll be so happy with us. Oh, right. You're an amnesiac. That probably doesn't mean much to you. A long story short, omens are trouble. They might be ones behind. They might be the ones behind quietness. Are you just gonna leave it here? You got me. You're right. I can't pretend I didn't see it. Matt, right? Dad. Don, don, don. Come on, let's carry it outside. Oh, wait. Did she mean, like, her dead father's memory of, like, his... He would also treat anyone? I thought she meant that the omen was her dad, and he was talking to him. But that was mildly confusing. <laughs> Never mind. I take back the dun dun dun. It was inside. It's still alive. We're gonna keep calling this person an it. <laughs> Just because we don't like him. Or them. Or it. That's not what I meant. Yes, I know, but I couldn't just leave it there. Press, Dim, have you found anything about the flying object? There. My goodness, I'm astounded. This is the crystal that crash landed here. It's enormous. Mayor, there was an omen inside it. Oh, yes, it does look like one. Mayor, please tell her we're not helping any omens. This was clearly all they're doing anyway. But it looks like it's an aim. And how does that concern you? Are you the traveler I've been hearing about? I hear rumors that you came afar during quietus. Yes, this is the person from the rumors. It's just been one thing after another. What on earth is going on? Mayor, all my beds are still full from last week's incident. But I can't just leave this wounded omen or this traveler here either. Indeed. But we cannot provide refuge to an omen in our town. I thought so, but as a doctor, I can't leave behind the injured under any circumstance. Calm down, Cress. I just said we cannot keep the omen inside Left Village. What do you mean? There's a spare shed on Birdside Bray, isn't there? No one would notice if you took it there. I grant you permission to treat it there until it regains consciousness. Thank you, Mayor, for shedding light on the situation. Ah. Now to carry this omen over to Bird's Eye Bray. But you lend me a hand, Traveler. Uh, I mean, you can't really keep it. I'd like it to stay attached, but... I could probably use both of them to carry the- Oh, that is what you meant? Okay, let's do the loading screen again. This is a well-furnished shed. Why are there beds in the shed? What is this thing made of? It just won't come off. Oh, you want to get it? You want to get its clothes off, eh? That's why it's pointless even trying to treat an omen. 
I suppose all you can do for now is let it rest. Now as for you, what brought you to our town? Ah, uh, well you see, I downloaded this demo from the eShop, and then I hit the A button. <laughs> Mayor, his memory was affected by quietness. I see. You were incredibly lucky to make it this far out during quietness. A girl saved me. A girl? Hmm, none of the villagers should have been out. His body was in a weakened state at the time. It's not unlikely he may have experienced hallucination. Perhaps. In any case, he could probably do with some rest. This shed has been vacant ever since the last owner left. You may use it as you please. Now excuse me, but I must be on my way to a village meeting. We have to decide on a plan of action regarding the crystal. Press dim. I'm leaving the rest with you. Press, are you sure you want to take in this omen? Yes. Here you go, kitty. Too involved again. Put yourself on the line too much. Going back to finish the round. Sorry, I've been so preoccupied with everything going on. What should I do now? You've been through much more than I have. Take it easy for the rest of the day. I'm sure your body must still be fighting off the effects of quietness. I'll leave you to it. I'm coming back to check on you tomorrow, alright? You are suddenly overcome with the feeling of tiredness. Time to get some rest. Hmm, that bed is shiny, but this bed has the omen in it. Ugh, the stuff. Ruined. I want to rest in this bed. Fine, we got a couple flowers. Seriously, why does the shed have this much stuff? I'm sure if I search the door, it's just going to say, I am tired. Leap. A game will autosave when you rest in bed. Chapter One. Somebody's here. Oh dear, were you still sleeping? It's already afternoon. Well, if you're sick, you're sick. Not much we can do about that. How are you feeling? I never got your name. Do you remember what it is? Um, well, it was like 39 minutes ago that I entered my name on the screen, but I think I still remember it. It's good you remember that much, at least. I'm gonna give you a quick once-over. Hold still, please. Hmm, okay. Still nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, that's right. The mayor asked me to give you something. Would you mind coming outside? It's not the most conventional gift, but here you go. Three carob seeds and three stellar wheat seeds. 
It looks like everyone in Left Village pitched in. You got a good plot of land here. I guess he's hoping you'll put it to use when you get back on your feet. Which I must say makes perfect sense from a doctor's perspective. It'll keep you busy since it's easy to feel gloomy or despondent when you don't have something to work towards. And when the mind suffers, so does the body. No point in dilly-dallying. Let's get to work. Don't worry, I'll teach you what to do. I'm not an expert, but I know the basics. You want me to help you? I'm a doctor, not a farmer. I can barely lift the tools by myself. Besides, doing it yourself is the best way to learn. Plow the earth, plant seeds, and water them while changing out your tools. Wow. Wow, yep, this is very much like Sakuna. Or you gotta till the soil. Now I have six seeds and now I have six squares. Okay. Arabs on the right. Uh, the wheat. I'm on watering can and now why? Crops on your farm need water every day. Hmm, sure, not half bad. You seem pretty good with your hands. Keep it up and I'm sure you'll have no problem. It was pretty tough. <laughs> really, you didn't make it look that way. But I guess the first try is always the hardest. You'll get used to it at your own pace. Not like you don't have an abundance of time on your hands, right? Although, this farm has seen better days. You must have had a hard time working on it. Yeah, those rocks are annoying. I can imagine. If you had a hammer or something, you could break down those rocks and have more space. I don't suppose you have one, do you? Nope, didn't quite get that lucky. Didn't think so. In that case, you'll just have to make one. You do it. Oh, it's best you make one for yourself. You're gonna have to be the one self-sufficient if you want to live here. You can make a hammer with some hard stone. But the stones are the thing that... I need stone for hammer, but I need hammer to stone. It seems like a very vicious cycle. You should be able to find the materials at the Nord Step. How do I get there? Boing, ding, follow the roadies. There are monsters though, so be careful. And, oh yeah, you can have this. You'll make me a sandwich, but not a hammer. You must be hungry after all that farm work. Here's something for you to eat. A good idea to fill your stomach before you head out. Because if you wait until you're weak and passed out, then it's already too late. So, you're to eat that and restore the energy you spent on good sandwich time. Cover stamina spent working on the farm or HP lost in battle by eating food. Some also buffs. Hunger gauge fills after eating. If it is lightly filled, your stamina will begin to recover on its own. That omen opens their eyes after I've left. Let me know right away.
Time passes automatically in this game. Your ability will be reduced and your actions limited as it gets later. When the clock reaches midnight, you will collapse from exhaustion. Sleep before then. <laughs> In that case, I won't really dilly-dally too much here. I need to head out the east gate. Ooh, shiny. Oh, I don't have a bomb to destroy the rock lift. Is this the gate? Hold on, map. Player... Oh, okay, so... Eastern road is behind the rock. Oh, also, how do I eat? Sandwich made by Cress, filled with fresh, crunchy green. Egg, and fried bacon. Spicy sauce really adds to the flavor. Like the sandwich. Options how to play. Options from before. Dog classes, okay. Just a hoe and a watering hen to my name. Oh, and a sandwich, I guess. So I'll eat, then I'm gonna wait until I actually, you know, head out. going the right way. I think I went the wrong way. Thought I went out the gate that she told me to go out. And... Especially because she said it was east. I went to the right on the map. Do I have mail? <laughs> Is that why you're telling me this? Guess I have mail. That's all Lewis time. Unknown objects lands in Lex. Greetings, citizens. Yesterday, a giant crystallized object descended upon Lex and crash landed in the village. Fortunately, no Lex residents were injured. The object is thought to pose no immediate threat to life unless close contact is made. Please rest assured that our intelligence division is investigating the incident. Once again, do not approach the object. Oh, there's the archway that I was supposed to go out. Explore left village or head east to Nord Step. Um, mm -hmm. you know what? The village might give me stuff. That'll make the journey a little easier. Since they told me I could do either one. Or maybe there's some side quests that I can do while I'm out there. I can see why the treehouse segment skipped ahead on this game because it's been a very Yeah, you know, it's, it's been a bit of a long open. I guess her husband can cook. Oh, no. Nope. Omelets are tasty, but sometimes misshapen. Suddenly upstairs. Well, thanks, empty room, for existing. In a game that has a time system, I'm very thrilled to see that there's stuff I can not do. Up 
telepathy. And... Face his feet. At least there were NPCs in that one. Come to visit relatives. Okay, bye. You don't do anything. General store would be open, but I don't think I have any money. Yeah, I have no money. It's on the bottom left of the party menu. In this Square Enix game, G stands for Gorilla. Not a name I would have thought of for currency, but... Oh, I can grab these chests now. Okay, the trip was worth it after all. <laughs> Got some seeds. That means there's other things I can grab. Hello. Some snooty guy has been coming by the general store. back to my house to sleep already. That seems super short, but then again, I guess we started in the afternoon. I, like, find one more treasure chest before I go back. There's this one. Alright, now, is there some... There's some means of just, like, go back to the world map. Or, I guess I have to walk there. Hmm. Well, I might collapse. Wait, is that a shiny spot? That is a shiny spot. Why would I leave when there's a shiny spot that close by? I got End of Eden 12, Growth. Well, no one will mind if I stop and read that. Story from the End of Eden. The Eden Soft Growth. You are not me. Kept using my name, then I'll... If that's how we're gonna do this, then fine by me. Snake slithers into the Eden of the never-ending quarrels. Partake in this apple. Put an end to these feuds, he preferred. So the fighting stopped. Then 64 became 32, and 32 became 16. Till only one was left. And so she, too, left paradise behind. Oh, whatever all that means. La, 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 la. This the way back. I suppose I could check. Nope, this is a different dead end, but maybe there's a chest behind this house. Bam, got some ore. Ready or not, here I come. Don't let the coppers know that I stole it. Aha, it's the way back. Oh, I still have plenty of time. It's only it's not even 8 p.m. in game yet. I'll make it before midnight. Here I was worried that I was going to lose all that time.
Put stuff in the storage box. I probably won't need this ore for a while. Ooh, do 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 so uh, I wasted away day grabbing the treasure chests that were originally behind hexagons in the village. Got some seeds and some ore. And now the game is warning me that I better go to sleep, dang it. That evening. There's a loud sound coming from the other bed. I don't know, wait. Hmm, I'm so tempted to pick the second one. I'm so very, 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 very tempted. Really? I kind of thought that was what would happen. <laughs> Way too loud to sleep, though. No, just do it. It'll be fine. You must be tired, right? We can grab people's treasure all day. That's the exact same text box, so fine, I'll go check on them. Someone had to test it. You know how it is. You say no enough, and sometimes stuff happens. Error. Error. Abnormality detected in life support system. It cause irreversible effects on the body. Conscious. Operator consciousness levels. Oh. Cognizant judgment. Possible. Second atmosphere. Composition. All amount of Gaia dust detected. Body affected by Gaia dust density. Rectifying. Guarding protective equipment. Are you? Girl is sleeping peacefully. I'll crest right away. have phones in this world or did we just run all the way to the village you're trying to tell me there was a human inside that omen armor this whole time I are you sure this girl was inside the omen armor yeah pretty sure fair enough I don't see what you would have to gain by lying it makes sense for her to have been in the omen armor the whole time the fabric of her clothing isn't anything I've seen before, either. I wonder where she's from. I bet she works for them. Shouldn't let your guard down just because she looks like us, Cress. Human wearing omen armor is pretty suspicious. Enough, Dim. There's no point jumping to conclusion. What would you like to do with her, Cress? Indeed, she's still unconscious, so we'll just need to wait and see for now. But Cress, what? What? We can't just abandon her, can we? I, you don't mind, do you? Hmm. Won't I be putting my life at risk? I care a lot about me. I understand your suspicion. We have no idea what this girl is capable of. Leave her in your care until then. Okay, suddenly I'm okay with this. Yeah, I can handle myself after all. Very good. It's quite late, so let's head back to the villain. Don't let your guard down. No excuses. I'll come back in the morning to see how things are going. Bye for now, I
Girl from the armory sleeping peacefully. Might be a good idea to get some sleep too. Yet I tried multiple times earlier, game. But you insisted it was too loud. Where the hell am I? Somebody's talking. Was investigating the Red Eden. Then, what happened in my gear? Ah, oh, this sucks. Seriously, what is this place? And she's gone. She went outside. No, can't be. New Red Queen. You're awake. You weren't you asleep in the other bed? What's with the getup? Morning, nine. You're a bird. Wait. I'll go get the mayor. Did she say mayor? I have a bad feeling about this. Whew. Oh, it's chilly out here. Or maybe my clothes are too thin. Whatever. I'm going back inside before I catch a cold out here. So, can you tell us where you're from, miss? Can you tell me what year it is first? Like, what calendar do you use? Lunar? Gregorian? I'm not sure how it'll help, but we use the Horian calendar, making it the year 855. Horian? Never heard of it. Though I don't get the impression any of you are making light of the situation. I speak the same language, so at least I've got that going for me. What are you? What do you have to do with the omen? Men's. I have honestly no idea what you're talking about. Playing coy, huh? Dim, that's enough. Let's listen to what she has to say. Thank you. We still don't know where you're from. I haven't figured that out myself. Are you a protagonist too? Oh, my fellow kin. How long I've waited to find another protagonist who understands how rough it is to wake up with no idea of who you are, where you are, or really anything about any social situation at all. I'm glad- I'm sure that if we stick together, us protagonists, we will conquer the world. I'm looking at the clothes you're wearing and the structure of this house. And I can't say I've ever seen any of it in the history book. Although, I guess they do resemble artifacts of what we would call the Middle Ages, where I'm from. Which leads me to draw only on one reasonable conclusion. I think I came here from the future. Yes, totally reasonable, fellow protagonist. Huh? What do you mean by that? Trust me, I want to believe this is all a bad dream. But I might have to accept that this is reality. It's safer to laugh at the lunatics, after all. Hey, you didn't want to catch a cold, right? I appreciate the concern. My theory is correct, and I am, in fact, from another time. Then I have to find a way back. 
I need to come up with a plan. Not only that, but I need to figure out why that stone has appeared in this time as well. A lot that needs to be done. We're already out of time. But if you went back in time, doesn't that by definition give you more time than what you already had? Because if you were out of time in the future, but you go back to the past, then how are you more out of time than you already gained time, did you not? <laughs> what do you think she meant by that? I don't know. It's me. Whatever. No point dwelling on it now. I should head back to work. Do you need me here? No, you go on ahead. There's still something I want to do here. Got it. Don't stay too late. So, fine. Those vegetables you planted yesterday should be ready now. That was one day. Let's go and harvest them. Okay, the game agrees. That was fast. Those particular seeds grow pretty quick. You don't mind if I take a look since I'm here already. Come on, let's go outside. The vegetables you planted are looking good. I can see you've done a fine job of taking care of them. I watered them once. So what now? Well, if you ship your crops, merchants can easily deliver them to families all over the world. And you'll earn yourself some money in the process. First, you should harvest your veggies. Now we're putting the harvest in Harvest Stella. In fact, we're harvesting the stellar wheat. Why am I pressing A and it's not working? I guess it only wanted me to pick the carrots. Now that's done, would you mind putting them in that blue shipping box over there? It looks like they're all in there. Your shipment should be collected at some point today. Then you'll receive money for everything tomorrow morning. You'll have to wait until then to see how much you sold for. And that about covers it. Some of the crops haven't fully grown yet. Don't forget to water them. I was worried about you in the beginning, but now I see you'll be just fine. Thank you, Cress, for showing him the rope. Anyway, Ayn, I actually have other matters to discuss with you. Would you mind coming inside? They really don't want to send me back out into the world again, do they? I'm just here waiting for the chance to go to that eastern path and fight some stuff. So I can at least show combat. This is the crafting table! As long as you've blah on craft, you know how to craft items, don't you? Do I really need all these text boxes to tell you? It's not that many text boxes, actually. And I use a return bell recipe. Let me say it again. It's an item I call the return bell. It's an item to have. It's handy. And you'll return home in the blink of an eye. I was wondering if I could do that earlier. If you find yourself losing track of time, try using it. 
will come in handy. You could make a- no. Oh, <laughs> you could make a hammer at the crafting table too. As long as you got the materials. I did not go out and get the materials. <laughs> unless those were the ones in the village. When you get a chance, please show your face at the stores. I kind of did that yesterday. There's the general store, the smithy, the renovator. I'm sure you're going to rely on them. Now then, I shall be heading back to the village. Me too. I don't want Dim getting upset with me. Have a good day, I... Craft with a recipe and also time and item. All those things go into it. Well, he gave me the return bell recipe, so... Throw that together. Alright, let me... First I'll eat my sandwich. Now, set off. Alright, we are now set, Luke's. Took some doing, but here we are. You know, there's a few things in this game that have reminded me of Xenoblade so far, but these enemy designs have got to take the cake on that. Why normal attack? Yeah, I beat him. Give me your seeds, fools. Areas where you can gain items by using stamina. Get two items from these areas that will replenish the following day. So like this. You got me. Alright, it said two items. There's dashing. Uses stamina. interested to see what other sorts of combat maneuvers we might get. I assume there will be a dodge at some point, a strong attack. Found it. Been sighted at the spring seas like The planetary nightmare. Most likely, yes. I have an idea. Let us reconvene and die with Dianthus and the others. Now oh, doesn't look like a good time to talk to them. Probably best to stay out of their way. I mean, I can't go any further at all. Nothing to be done over there. Maybe I should have come out here on the first day, because it didn't take me very long to get the materials from the spots and 
beat the enemies that they would allow me to actually fight. One material that I missed, right? Actually, I should be able to check. Not other. Encyclopedia crafting. I was hoping to check the recipe. Like, there should be a recipe for the hammer. I think it took hard stone. But I don't know how many. Okay, like it says the sun is setting at six. Hmm. Have a little bit of time. You know, I, I may be pushing it here. But what's really stopping me from going back to this village here? I could always waste my return bell if I need to. In. Already went to the general store. Did I? No, I did not go. Because I did not have money. I'm gonna get money tomorrow from the carrots, but. Mayor said to stop in. Welcome to the general store. You're a traveler of some sort. Don't see many of those. Oh, it's you, is it? I heard all about you from the mayor. Sounds like you've been through a lot. Heard you started farming on Bird's Eye Bray. In that case, you're gonna need some seeds. Right now, it's the best season for dress lettuce and union onion. Union onion. And we just so happen to be fully stocked on those. We also have travel essentials, and you can buy meals. Yeah, I have no money. Not yet. <laughs> hey, bye then. See if I can find those other shops that he was talking about. Oh, map. Fishing spots I can't really do yet. A little further southwest, there is something. But I'll go to the one in the northwest first. Then hit the other one on the way out. This? I don't often see out of towners turning up here. You must be a traveler. Ah, you're the one everyone's talking about. You're a new resident. Well, I'm the smithy. I make all farming equipment and weaponry for people in town. All that a smithy's instinct, but there will come a time when you're going to need a stronger weapon than that. So, with that in mind, don't hesitate to come to me. I'll need materials and labor fee, but I promise you won't be disappointed. Alright, well, I have no labor fee capability right now, so. Bye bye. Doing what the mayor asked me to do so that it won't bar my story progress. Done the right. Now turn here. Must be that renovator I heard about. Hmm. I haven't seen you before. 
Hmm, I see now. You're the kid the mayor's been talking about. Beg your pardon. I run the renovator here in Lead. I'm the one everyone comes to when buildings and farms reconstruct restructured. You live over in Bird's Eye Bray, is that right? Have a lot of farmland there. Probably gonna need sheds and pens for keeping animals, eh? You get pets? Not to mention tools for processing your crops. There should be a lot you're gonna need down the road. Well, when the time comes, speak to me. I'll help you out. I don't work for free, obviously, but we can go over that later. Welcome. Alright, now I should still have enough time on the clock. Back home without using the bell. Or at least I'm hoping that would be the case. Okay, four hours until midnight. Did I get back at 8, 10 p.m. two days in a row? What kind of coincidence is that? Oh, you know what? I didn't water these. The Y button. Alright, and I can start planting some other stuff. Right mind should do this at like this hour of the night, but I am doing it to try and get the most out of whatever I'm able to do. Uh, sure, we can plant a tiny bit of grass. Oh, now it's forcing me into the house. Alright, well, I got those planted and watered, so... That's good. A sleep game, but it's because you're making me. Coming in. Sleeping outside is out of the question, so I'll be staying in here for now. Just go about your business as though I'm not even here. Well, I would hate for you to catch a cold. Are you showing concern? Look, I don't plan to stick around. I already have an idea of what to do next. More or less. Anyway, good night. I got 345 Grindle. Grilla sounds like one of those fake rap terms, like when you're making a fictional rap and you're making up slang. Like someone would call, totally call money Grillo. Go get out of my grill. I'll be spending my grilla. And if you mess with me, I'm gonna go a gorilla. Oh, you're awake. Morning. 
You all right? Let me know if you're feeling off anywhere. Oh, well, good. I take it that girl has already left, then. The doctor, I do wish she would have stayed and rested. But I doubt she would have listened to me anyway. In any case, let me know right away if anything happens, all right? Thanks. Did you get the money from yesterday's veggie shipment? Great. Might be a good idea to buy some new vegetable seeds with that money. They sell seeds at the general store. I wonder which ones I should buy. Well, the siding is all part of the fun, isn't it now? I'll do everything I can for now. What you do from now on is up to you. You might choose to expand your farm or grow more different kinds of crops. Just try out lots of things and learn as you go along. All from me for today. Well, I believe the tutorial shackles have been released. I'll take all of this stuff. I guess the grass is still growing. I don't know what we're going to do with grass, to be honest. That's all the seed. Now. Okay, I could cook with these, but for now I'm just gonna sell them. Make flour when process. Oh, when did I get these? <laughs> Hold on, I'll go plant though. We were told that's a good seasonal item right now. Cool berry can be made into a juice. Oh, you know what? I should check the crafting table. Have that hammer. Seems like I don't necessarily need it right away, but... Oh, I need ten of those stone. Apparently that's all I need, but... Ten of them. Said there might be some here in the Bray. I wonder if I just look around here a little bit if I'll find some... Um, here's a spot. <laughs> Well, it's stones, but yeah, there's stuff just around the house. Then up here on this hill, wasn't there another hexagon? Yeah. Hey, another return bell for free. I approve of that message. Get free stuff. Ah, you thought you could hide the goods behind my house. It's my house, and so sometimes I'll look behind it and... Bet you didn't think of that, huh? That crystal looks fun. I don't have a level 2 bone. That's a shame. Can't wait to make some explosions, though. Maybe that's what this game is actually all about. Some random person comes into town. Claims to have no idea who they are, but in reality, they are just the destroyer of chaos. <laughs> Here to craft bombs and blow everything up.
Yeah, man, it's worth just looking around here. There's a chest that I cannot grab, and it makes me sad. I might have cash, or something that can be turned into cash. Oh, treasure box. I the socks that I can't reach you. You seem so distant because you are. I cannot fly. I don't have a fishing rod. Oh yeah, that other bomb wall from earlier is up. Oh wait, it's down there. I guess there's more up there after all. But I'll look there a different time. Already going this way. Aha, stuff. Alright, what's my inventory like now? I'm halfway there. a bomb symbol there, but that looks like something that'll move later. Especially with the path on the map. Stop in at the village because I got some Rillo. Got some gorilla home gorilla. I told you it's just like a made up word. Gorilla like gorilla. What have you got in store for me now, General Thor person? Backpack level two? Hmm, a bit short of that. Fishing skill! I mean, I guess they show that this is a book, but it seems a little weird that you can just buy the ability to fish. I thought I just needed to make a fishing rod. I didn't have that availability yet. But I guess not. Nah, forget the actual rod. All you need is reading. <laughs> Unions are expensive. It was recommended that I buy more seeds, so you know what? Take one of the expensive ones, because you know... Probably gonna get a decent profit margin if it costs that much. Plant one more of those. Probably that left me a little bit to save up with. Pretty sure it did. I had 345. Hmm. 
Mm, okay, by the time I walk over to that place, it's gonna be too late, so I'll just try and plant those real quick before the next day passes. This part of the game is very therapeutic to them. Okay, so just take it easy and put stuff in the ground. I mean, the demo is gonna limit how many days you're able to spend in the game to um, day 15, according to the message we got at the beginning, but to get the full game, it seems like you can really just have at it. However much of that you want. It hasn't been implied that there's a time limit or anything yet. Of course, I hope the whole thing with this game is like, quiet, this is gonna come back. When the four seasons are over, and so... That might be something to be mindful of, but otherwise... There's a sound coming from the other bed. Did I wake you? Sorry about that. Is that a book? More a diary than a book. My mom always told me to keep a handwritten record of daily events. I always thought it was silly, but here I am, getting some use out of it after all. Really okay to tell you, I wonder. Find out. I'm confirming who I am and how I live my life. A diary is probably the only way I can do that now. Okay, I've seen little bits of every Xenoblade game that I've played in this one in some way. This diary thing is the most recent one. I won't specify which one it's from though. Must have been pulled here by a rib in the fabric of space-time. Something along those lines. If the course of history has changed, then there's a good chance that the future I know no longer exists. But if I have memories of what's written in here, then I'm reaffirming that what I remember is still real. It's a small comfort knowing I haven't completely altered my memories or vanished due to some time paradox. But all that aside, this diary is all the proof I have that I am who I am. Yeah, gotcha. All you need to know is that this diary is something like a compass that'll help me get back to my own. You do have compasses in this time, right? No, all that talk about going east earlier was nothing. I want to go home, but if I have no recollection of where home is, how would I know which way to go? Enough lecturing for one day. Tired. Good night. Getting that gorilla. That's almost enough to buy fishing. Right, it's your turn to be the omen this time. What? Wait, how come you get to decide? Who are you anyway? Sounds like some people are talking outside. Alright, but, on that note, I think that's as good a place as any to stop. I mean, 
I could try and marathon the rest of the demo right now, but who knows how much longer I could spend on this, especially if I'm taking my sweet time on the farm. I do wish I was able to show a little more of the combat, but I guess you can always go to the Nintendo Treehouse for that. Or I could pick up where I left off on another stream. That's who be decided at this point, but... There we go. Uh, feels like there's good potential here. But I would definitely recommend playing the rest of the demo out to really know for sure. And I had that same experience with Triangle Strategy. The part of the demo I played on stream was good and it showed the game had potential. But it wasn't until I finished the demo with that third chapter that I was finally sold on the game. And yeah, that whole game ended up being really darn good, actually. <laughs> so, I'm gonna do the same for Harvestella, whether that's on or off stream. I'll see the rest of the demo through and then I'll know for sure, but I do see promise here. That and thanks for stopping by this first impression stream. Hope you have a good rest of your night. Night.